Hello everyone and welcome back to another video here inside of Cold War Zombies. This glitch will be an easy XP slash camera glitch you guys can use on the map 5AC, but there is a catch. This spot can be a lethal spot if you guys don't know the method in the glitch. So in this video, I'd recommend you guys watch it to the end so you guys are aware and fully confident in the glitch. But without further ado, let's hop right into the spot. On the map 5 AC, come toward the Scorch Defense area and you're going to want to keep at least one or two zombies left in the round. You are then going to want to approach the sandbags and the approach we are doing is basically jumping at the sandbag but pushing a little bit back as we do so. The animation we are looking for is that we are mantling toward the edge of the sandbag and this will make us float in the spot. To get this near every time, come to the corner of the sandbag, then mantle onto the edge and then this should push you onto the spot. So to restate that, we're not the ones pushing the game, so basically let the sandbag do it for you. Anyhow, once you get it for the first time, you should get the hang of it, so basically keep on attempting it and eventually you should get it. Now that you are in the glitch, we're gonna go through the method which you guys must choose so that you guys are safe in this spot. The first thing to note is that if you do not shoot a zombie for around 6 to 7 seconds, he will throw a meat at you. Another thing to worry about is that if a lot of zombies are left unkilled below you, they can all throw a meat at you, so make sure you guys are watching out for that. So the method we're going to use is basically keep on spamming these zombies below you and if you guys keep on shooting these zombies as they first come you should be able to go through the rounds no problemo. To kill the zombies fast I recommend that you guys have the shadow blast ammo mod just so you guys can keep on going through zombies as soon as you guys can. Another part of the method is having the frost blast field upgrade at your disposal. The reason why we use this field upgrade is that it charges fast and in case these zombies start piling up in a big horde you guys can simply use this and it should be no longer a threat. So as you're killing zombies down below you, if your frost blast field upgrade is ready for you, simply use that and keep on rinsing and repeating to go through the rounds fast. One last thing about this one is that when the mangler comes, make sure that you guys shoot his arm off as fast as you can. The reason why this is so important is that the mangler can shoot you off the glitch with his long range attack. So when the mangler spawns in, focus all your fire onto his arm and shoot that thing off. As we are heading near the end of the video, there is one last thing you guys must watch out for. On Assault Rounds, I know you guys don't want to exit the glitch, but there is a way you guys can go through the round but not actually having to go and complete the Assault Wave. To do this, simply stay in the spot, do not worry about the Assault Round, and simply it would go through by itself and all you will lose is the power in that specific area. So if I lost it in the Scorch Defense, let's say I lose a power to the Stamina Up Machine and the Armor Stand. And better yet, if you guys want power back in that area, simply go toward that Aether Generator and simply restart it. As long as you guys are focusing on the zombies which are down below you, you can actually use this as a pretty nice and neat XP slash camera glitch. Anyways, that is it for today's video. If you guys have enjoyed the video or if you guys have found it helpful, then please do consider smashing the like button as it does help the video spread out to more viewers on the platform. Anyways, till next time, goodbye.